Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to protect your digital downloads in WooCommerce WordPress. Basically guys, the digital WooCommerce is pretty much like so. For example, let me just open an example. Here as you can see, I am actually selling iPhone X, Pringles and Pringles. So I'm not having actually like a physical, uh, I'm not having like a digital uh, service or product. But in, in another thing, uh, a digital product is something like a software, a service, uh, a gift card like number, and so go on. So these are the kinds of the digital products that you can sell. So these ones that I have here are actually physical products. So how you can actually protect your digital products? Because physical products are easy to protect because there is no need actually to protect them. So how you can actually protect the digital product? That's what I'm show, going to show you in here. First of all, I will need you guys to go to your dashboard, go to plugins and add new. And make sure that you have WooCommerce in your WordPress website. Here you can click on install now and then activate it. After that, guys, go to install plugins and check if it is active in here. If so, if that was the case, click on refresh, so you will have this menu over here. Now, what you have to do is actually get the premium version of WooCommerce so you can make your digital products, which is pretty simple. You can just go to WooCommerce, extensions, search for digital, and here guys, you will be able, not here, and let me just search for it, my subscriptions I mean, and here when you connect your account, you will find your digital products. So after that guys make your or like make your product from here add new and make your product and when you finish with that make sure guys that when whenever you create an order so add order over here whenever you make an order make here a downloadable product permission so here you must add it and here leave a note a private note which is only the customer can see through here with informations about the digital product that it will receive. After that, just click on create and everything will be good and your digital product will be safe. So guys, that was it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and thank you guys for watching.